Who in the world is King Louis Roman XVI? Well... Louis Roman XVI, 1754 minus 1793, born Louis Auguste, was the last king of France before the French Revolution. He succeeded his grandfather, King Louis Roman XV, in 1774. His reign of 18 years saw the decline of the French monarchy and ultimately its destruction in the revolution. Louis Roman XVI was an intelligent and largely well-intentioned ruler, but he faced numerous challenges. He inherited a large debt from his predecessor and was unable to control the costs of the government, resulting in high taxes and further economic hardship for the people of France. He was also unable to respond effectively to the rising tide of revolutionary thought in France, which ultimately led to his overthrow. His legacy is complex, but largely negative. He is remembered for his inability to contain the forces of revolution and reform, as well as the failure of his rule to bring prosperity or stability to France. Despite his efforts to improve the economy of France, his reign was marked by economic hardship and eventually the French Revolution. His execution in 1793 marked the end of the French monarchy and the beginning of a new era in French history. Louis Roman, 1674 minus 1793, born Louis August, was the last king of France before the French Revolution. He succeeded his grandfather, King Louis Roman, 15, in 1774. His reign of 18 years saw the decline of the French monarchy and ultimately its destruction in the Revolution. Louis Roman XVI was an intelligent and largely well-intentioned ruler, but he faced numerous challenges. He inherited a large debt from his predecessor and was unable to control the costs of the government, resulting in high taxes and further economic hardship for the people of France. He was also unable to respond effectively to the rising tide of revolutionary thought in France, which ultimately led to his overthrow. His legacy is complex, but largely negative. He is remembered for his inability to contain the forces of revolution and reform, as well as the failure of his rule to bring prosperity or stability to France. Despite his efforts to improve the economy of France, his reign was marked by economic hardship and eventually the French Revolution. His execution in 1793 marked the end of the French monarchy and the beginning of a new era in French history.